first honoree tonight brings together two of Italy's greatest qualities, high style and fashion combined with a savvy business sense. Please take a look at our dear friend, Federica Marchioni. My family is from Santa Severa on the seaside near Rome. I think that when you grow up surrounded by beauty that help your imagination to, to go beyond uh, just the normal um, everyday standards, then really you can, uh, you, you can be innovative in, in many ways. Innovative is one way to describe Federica's career. Early on embracing technology and telecommunications, senior VP at Ferrari, Dolce & Gabbana executive, and most recently when she was CEO of Land's End, supporting environmental initiatives she's very proud of. I made um, an agreement with the National Forest Foundation to plant one million trees. We made a partnership with the uh, U.S. Lighthouse Society, making sure that those lighthouses will be restored. I want to live with purpose. I want to continue my life in doing something and make something better. At least I want to try my best in everything that I can possibly do. And her most important role? Raising her eight-year-old son Gabriel as a citizen of the world. I'm trying to expose him as much as I can to things that uh, we can then talk about it and, and, and learn. Federica is also a big proponent of the arts, cultural institutions to rock and roll. I love you two and Bono for his uh, commitment to different things in the world. And I love opera. I support the Metropolitan Opera here in New York uh, with the Consulate of Italy to have the subtitle of the Italian opera in Italian. Federica's lifestyle is definitely glamorous and exciting, but she's never lost sight of her true self. And being an honoree today is the thrill of a lifetime. I'm truly honored. <laughs> I will be the most um, humble, proud, chin up, and uh, very happy to share that moment with my son.